Hello, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist of Tech Travel Geeks, and this is the unboxing of the Xiaomi A3. If you haven't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks on YouTube. Uh, we do unboxings of products, reviews, first impressions, how-tos, and the Tech Travel Geeks podcast. Right, so this is a parcel that I ordered from our friends at eGlobal Central. And it is the Xiaomi A3. The Xiaomi A3 is an Android One device, which means you get a Google-like experience. So something similar to what you get uh, on a Google Pixel. Now, as you can see, eGlobal Central have packed package this very very carefully it's very safely packaged and I'm cutting through a lot of bubble wrap to get at packaging of the phone itself and as you can see there's a sign that says that there's an adapter on the inside so here's the box of the Xiaomi A3 itself and eGlobal Central very kindly include a UK plug adapter because I'm assuming that this will have a two-prong Asian adapter. But we'll see in a moment. Put this aside. So as you can see, nice packaging with the Xiaomi A3 uh, logo on it. The side says that it's a Xiaomi Mi A3 with Android One with Google Assistant. So the Android One logo and the Google Assistant logo in prominence. And over here, you will also see that there is information on the device. It has a 48 megapixel AI triple camera, 4,030 milliamp hour battery, fast in-screen fingerprint sensor, and a Snapdragon 665 chipset. So that's an interesting thing. And in fact, you can see there is a two-prong plugged in the box. So I'm going to cut open the cellophane. I'm going to put a pair of scissors. Get that off. And I think we're done with the scissors at this point. I'll put them aside. And now I'm going to pull the box open. It opens up. My cat is getting very excited by this. You can hear him outside. And on the inside, you don't see anything. So all in cardboard on the inside. There's a box here which contains a SIM ejector tool and a Xiaomi A3 user guide and a warranty card. But more importantly, this contains its soft silicon case for the Xiaomi A3, which is very handy. Um, this isn't my preferred type of case, but it's nice to have it in the box. You can see it has all the appropriate cutouts for cameras, ports, headphone jack, microphone and infrared blaster. I will use this to keep the device safe until my Mokadile arrives. I have ordered some Mokadile on mine. And then on the very inside of the box we get the device itself. So here you see the Xiaomi A3, nice soft touch plastic bag. And you can see the screen protector on the front isn't one that you would leave on the device because it has all the branding and details on it. So you can see all those details about the 48 megapixel camera, the 4030 milliamp hour battery, in-screen fingerprint sensor and the Qualcomm Snapdragon 665. Now, first impression is that the device is a little heavy, but that's to be expected. That big battery and the glass, Gorilla Glass build will do that. And you can see on the sides, it's very, very blue. Let me take the back screen protector off. And yes, this is uh, not just blue. Very interesting that Xiaomi has taken to having its branding vertically here similar to what we saw on the Huawei P series from the uh, P20 Pro onwards. Uh, the 48 megapixel AI camera, triple camera set up here. And the Android One logo, the new Android One logo in uh, the bottom left. And all the usual 
uh, stickers, but it is very stunning color. Um, it's like there's lots of different radio waves reflecting and refracting in the light here. It is gorgeous. And for a device that's around about £160, that's amazing that you can get such value from the device. But I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause this as we turn the device on and start setting it up. But what I'll do before I do that is just show you what the Android One logo looks at startup, the water drop notch at the top of the screen. And I'm going to pause this video, set up the device, and then give you some first impressions of the software, the Android One experience. And I'm back. I've just finished setting up the gorgeous Xiaomi A Mi A3. And it is a pure Google experience. I'd say the only thing that stands out here is that there is a folder of Xiaomi apps. Um, throughout the setup process, I was taking a few notes. The screen is not a full high definition one. It's a 720 HD plus screen. Uh, but honestly, in with my old eyes, um, I'm not noticing a big difference comparing it to a full HD one. Colors are lovely and vibrant. That's because this is an AMOLED screen. And I have to say the in-screen in fingerprint scanner is fast. It's not as fast as it is on my Huawei P30 Pro or on the Xiaomi Mi 9T, but for a device under 160 pounds sterling, you're getting a device that doesn't have a fingerprint scanner on the back, but it's an in-screen in fingerprint scanner. And, oh, okay. It does, it's not the fastest, but it is very fast. I, I would argue that this is faster than it is on the Huawei Mate 20 Pro, uh, which was a flagship device from late 2018. So apart from that, um, it seems to be quite fast. It's currently completing the setup by doing the installation of uh, Google Play updates and downloading the latest Google security patch. And as you can see, it's white interface. It's very googly. And this particular one um, has, let's have a look. This one is currently uh, running, I believe, the June 2019 update, but it is currently updating to a newer version. And you can see it is a pure Android experience, the pure Google launcher experience. It's all uh, there. And the power button is easily accessible with my right thumb on the right hand side of the device. The volume rocker is just above that, easily findable by a tactile feel. Uh, another thing, obviously this device uh, is aimed for the European market. It has a European Xiaomi charger. This particular one is a 5 volt 2 amp one, so no fast charging on this charger. Uh, and it comes with a USB Type A to Type C cable because the Xiaomi A3 uses Type C. Uh, at the top, as I said, there is a courage port that's a 3.5 millimeter audio jack as well as an infrared blaster. Very useful feature if you travel and go to hotels a lot. Don't have to touch those grubby remote controls. The Google Play Store on this device, as it comes out of the box, is the old green one. But I'm sure that once I update it, let's have a look. Play Store version. Oh, I don't want to be a developer just yet. Let's have a look. Yes, it will download a new version of the Google Play Store. Anyway, so this was the first unboxing of the Xiaomi Mi A3 Android One device. It is gorgeous, it is shiny, and I will be using this in the coming week at IFA as a backup device to record video and upload it to the YouTube channel. Thank you for watching this video, and if you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on uh, YouTube.
and I'll just leave you with some shiny pictures of the Xiaomi A3 refracting light.